Well, let's see, it's time. Hello, teacher. Hello, Guillermo. You're still working, right? Yes. Oh. Good evening. Oh. Good evening. No problem, no problem. Just let me know, okay? Solo okay. me avisa. Okay, okay. okay. Let's see. Ana Maria, hello, good evening. Hello, teacher, good evening. How are you? Hi, Fine. Fine, that's cool, that's cool. How was your day? ¿Qué tal ese día? Very tired. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Very tired. Oh, my. Why? Trabajé más. Oh, really? A lot of work? Yes. Okay, okay. And tell me, what time did you finish working? ¿A qué hora salió? From work. Four. Very three. Okay, and tell me what time did you get home? I can get a casa. Diez minutos después. Ten minutes. Oh, really? That was fast. Yes. yes. Okay, that's cool. Excellent, excellent. So, did you have dinner already? Yes. Okay, what was there for dinner? No sé cómo se dice relleno de camarón. Oh, my gosh. That's delicious. Nice, nice. What else? What else? Tell me. ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? Rice. Okay. Shrimp, rice. Mm, sounds nice. Suena bien. <laughs> excellent, excellent. Okay, what did you drink? Coffee? No, tea. Sí. Sí, de, de manzanilla. Té okay. de manzanilla. Chamomile tea. Chamomile. Chamomile tea. Oh, really? Well, that's nice. Uh, to be honest, uh, man, I love coffee. So uh, for me, I like tea. I like tea. I won't lie to you. But if I have to choose between tea and coffee, of course, I always take coffee. Yo solo café en las mañanas. En la noche really? no, puedo, no puedo dormir si tomo café. Oh, my gosh. Well. Okay, okay. Well, thank you very much, Ana Maria. Nice having you here. Okay, okay, let's see. Mm -hmm. Robert, hello, how are you? Hello, teacher, good evening. I'm fine. And what about you? 
I'm just fine, just fine, you know, same old story as usual. Yeah. Just working and working, that's life for me. What about you? How was your day? Today, today I, I feel super tired. Why? Yeah. Yesterday, last night I was studying the platform that you sent me. Oh, that's cool, that's cool. Yeah. Oh, and you've been practicing. That's always nice, right? It's it's always good to be practicing a little bit more. Always nice. Yeah, teacher. I was studying. Excellent. Yeah. I have to. I had to sleep super too late oh really i had to sleep too late okay okay yeah it's this in this way but i had to go sleep I... yeah yeah well the good thing is that you are practicing, that's always cool. You are here ready for the class, that's even better, that's excellent. Yeah, for sure. Okay, that's cool, that's cool. Well, Robert, welcome to the class. Nice having Thank you, you here. Thank you, Tisha. Oh, thanks to you. Okay, let's see. Uh, 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 Judy, where's Judy? Hello, Judy. Hello, teacher. How are you? Very well. Very well? Yes. That's nice. That's nice. And tell me, what did you do today? Mm -hmm. Working. Working? Okay, and tell me what time did you finish working? Four, um, 33. Okay, what time did you get home? Mm, Father at six. Okay, quarter to six. Wow. Took you long enough. Le llevo su ratito. Yes. Okay, well, excellent, excellent. Good to have you here, Yuri, and welcome. Thank you, teacher. Okay, let's see. Monica Liliana, hello, how are you? Monica. Hello. Hello, teacher. Hello, how are you? So so. So so? Okay. Tell me, how was your day? Um go away. How was your day? ¿Cómo se dice con gripe? Oh, I got the flu. I got the flu. Really? Así es la suerte que tengo, teacher. Yeah, you're very lucky, right? When did it start today? Ahora le comenzó. Um, no, ya tengo dos días. Okay, okay. Uh, well, so sorry for you. It's terrible. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Well, Monica, nice having you here. Let's hope you get better. Esperemos que se ponga mejor. Thank you. 
Let's see, Catherine, hello. Hello. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. And you? I'm just fine, just fine. Here, same old story as usual. Well, <laughs> siempre. What about you? How was your day? What did you do today? Una pregunta a la vez, por favor. What did you do today? <laughs> okay, sorry. Como me acaba de decir la respuesta, ya me olvidó. Lo mismo de siempre. The same as usual. Okay, what's the same as usual? ¿Qué es eso? Tell me the activities you perform. I'm working. Okay, what time do you check in? ¿A qué hora entra? Uh, at 7 p.m. Uh, okay. No. A.m. <laughs> How many breaks do you have? ¿Cuántos recesos tiene? Uh, two. Okay, what time are they? ¿Qué horas? El... For... ¿Cómo se dice desayuno? Breakfast. Así. Ok, breakfast, yes. Ajá, uh -huh. at, at A. Hasta. Las, quiero ver. <ríe> Como no salgo, no me acuerdo. 20 minutos en la mañana. Ok, 20 minutes in the morning for breakfast, that's nice. Uh -huh. Y a lunch, eh, 11 at. 11 45 11 45 11 45 Okay 11 45 In the afternoon one shift En la tarde un solo turno Yes Muriendo okay. de hambre What time does your afternoon shift start? ¿A qué hora comienza su turno de la tarde? Um, a las 11.45 empieza otra vez. Ok, from 11.45 to... ¿Hm? La 11.45, ¿ah? No, de las 11 a las 11.45 es mi yeah. receso. Ok, from 11.45 to... De las 11.45 hasta las... 40... Four, four, four thirty. Thirty. Okay. Salgo a desayunar dos veces. That's cool. <laughs> what time did you get home? E at five. At five. Very fast. So as soon as you get home, you eat. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Okay, okay. Excellent. So, what was there for dinner? Six at six. And what did you eat? ¿Qué comió? Y tortita de, de pollo. Oh, really? Y arroz. Mm, that's nice. Chicken and rice. Y, y este, ensalada de pepino, tomate, cilantro, cebolla, de todo lo que encontré, leche. Okay, whatever you got handy was in there. Okay. <laughs> that's cool, that's cool, excellent, excellent. Well, Catherine, nice talking to you, welcome. Thank you, teacher. Algún día voy a aprender bien inglés para hablar en inglés. <laughs> well, keep on trying. Try not to use Spanish. Trate no usar el español. The words that you know, use them. Las palabras que conoce, úselas. No, y es que se me traba todo. Yeah, but you know what's the problem? That you are trying to start saying long sentences. Use the words you know. Mire, no va a comenzar de un solo con las oraciones largas. Comience con las palabras que ya domina. ¿Ok? Uh -huh. Ok. Muchas gracias. So, Thank slowly, you. slowly, ¿ok? <laughs> Let's see. David, hello, how are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? How was um, your day? Good. 
Oh, you yeah, told me you today. You told me you were going to receive a container today, right? Yes, two containers. Two, two today. containers today. Ouch. So how was yes. it? Heavy? Todo pesado? Um, how so? Okay, okay. So, what time did you get home today? Um, the coming icon and um, the, the six painting. Six oh, really? That's yes. six, six fifteen or six fifty? Six fifteen. Okay. Las, como las seis, como diez, seis cincuenta, algo así. Yeah, six fifty. That's late. Sí, este, so you are just arriving, va llegando. Yes, es que go strong and uno lo cuenta. Oh, really? Sí. So the, there was traffic. On the, on the, no, on the boy, on the buses. Oh, oh, that's why pupusas are the guilty ones. Las pupusas yeah, yeah, son el problema. La <laughs> okay, yeah. okay, okay. Excellent, excellent. Well, David, welcome to the class. Thank you, teacher. You are welcome. Let's see. Fatima Lisette, hello. Hello, teacher. How are you? Very good. Okay, excellent, excellent. And tell me, what did you do today, Kaysoy? Uh, work a lot. Work a lot? Okay, what time did yes. you get home? What? What time did you get home? ¿A qué hora llego a casa? Um, five. At five, okay. Yes. So, so you, did you have tener. dinner? ¿Cómo? Did you have dinner already? Yes or no? Yes. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. What did you have for dinner? And seven y banana. A banana. Yes, uh, coffee and Miller. Oh, really? Okay. And with the class, I hope, and have coffee con pan dulce. <laughs> okay, okay. Well, that's a lot. <laughs> Fueron varias cosas. Uh, no, eso and um, the, the, the finish the class. Oh. Con pan dulce. Lo otro era solo para mientras. Oh my gosh. <laughs> excellent, excellent. Well, Fatima, nice having you here. Welcome. Thank you, teacher. Okay, let's see. <laughs> Carla Beatriz, hello. Hello, teacher. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Okay, okay, and okay. You? Well, I'm just fine, just fine. Same old story, you know. So tell me, oh. what have you done today, Kaysoy? Um, work, working, <laughs> trabajar working. mucho. Sí, yes. Um, jugar con mis amigos. Play with my friends. Okay. What did you play? Um, 
Fútbol. Soccer. Yes. Oh, really? Oh, that's um, nice. What time do you play soccer? ¿A qué hora juega? Um, como viene I can hold a la a de Ok, got it, got it. Well, so glad for you. Qué bien por usted. Welcome to the class, miss. Nice having you here. Thank you, Thank you teacher. Thanks to you. <laughs> ok, enjoy it, enjoy it. <laughs> Thank you. Ok, ok. Let's see. Hey, Roxana, how are you? Hi, teacher. How are you? Uh, fine. Okay, how was your day? Uh, a little heavy, but... Um, home resting. Resting. Resting at home. That's yes. nice. Okay, okay, okay. Excellent, excellent. Thanks. And tell me, what time did you get home? ¿Qué hora llegó? 5.30. Yeah. Okay, okay. And did you have dinner already? Uh, yeah. And ri rice and chicken. Y me oh. quedé sin tortilla. Oh my gosh, there was no tortilla. No tortilla. Ouch. That was so bad. What did you drink? Coffee, water, milk? Coffee. Okay, okay. That's... Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. Well, a coffee is for relaxing. It doesn't have nothing to do with sleeping or not sleeping, my dear. Well, welcome to the class. Nice having you here. Thanks, teacher. Nah, thanks to you. Thanks to you. Good to have you here. Okay, guys, let's see. Let me get the attendance, please, before we move on. Ana Maria Rivas Duran. Present teacher. Brenda Angelica Díaz de Chacón. Present teacher. Sandy Sibania Rodríguez Leiva. David Armando Romero Hernández. Present teacher. Fátima Laura Mejía Meléndez. Present teacher. Fátima Lisset Pineda Paniagua. Present. Guillermo Josué Osorio Ventura. Present. Jaime Enrique Flores Sánchez. José Roberto Ramírez Beltrán. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, thank you. Present Omar. teacher. Present. Karen Tatiana Menéndez Aguirre. Karen Zuleima López Martínez. Carla Beatriz García de la O. Present teacher. Catherine Guadalupe García Chachagua. Present. Libni Rocío Rivera Lemos. Mónica Liliana Ocotán Barahona. Present. Nelson Stanley Cardona Hernández. Present. Patricia Verónica Linares Mengíbar. 
Roxana Elizabeth Ramírez Lima. Present, teacher. Víctor Alberto Trujillo Cruz. Present. Yuri Magdalena Villanueva de Trinidad. Present. Okay, excellent, guys. Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Do I still, yeah, I still got a couple of minutes. Victor, hello, Victor, how are you? Hello, teacher, I am fine. How was your day, mister? Uh, my day was good. Okay. What did you do today? Cowboy. Uh, only work. Only work, as usual. Yes, yes, the same usual. The same, the same routine. Usual. Yeah, I can imagine. What time did you get home? Uh, at five ten. Five ten. Oh, early. Yes. What do you usually do when you get home? ¿Qué suele hacer? Uh, I watching TV and drink coffee. Oh, okay, cool. So you relax totally. Yes. Yeah. Excellent, excellent. It is grow thin coffee. Yeah, yeah, that's a good routine, Victor. Thank you. So dinner is after class. Yes, uh huh. Okay. Dinner after class. That's interesting. Okay, okay. Now, let's see, let's see, let's see. Victor, welcome to the class. Nice having you here. Thank you. Excellent. Okay, guys, now, did you notice the activity that I did with uh, Catherine? I was asking her about her schedule. Okay, now, ¿se fijaron en la actividad que hice con Catherine? I was asking her about her schedule. Le preguntamos de su horario. So, right now, I need you to think about that, to think about your schedule, okay? What time do you wake up? What time do you start working? Let me get you the questions that we are going to be working with. Oopsie. Where had it gone? All oh, right here. Okay, the first question is this. What time do you wake up? What time do you leave? What time do you leave home? What time do you leave home for work? What time do you arrive to your job. What time do you have lunch? And what time do you get back home? Okay, guys, you got one, two, three, four, five questions. What time do you wake up? What time do you leave home for work? What time do you arrive to your job? What time do you have lunch? What time do you get back home? Okay, those are the questions you are going to be using for the activity. You are going to be asking and answering with your classmates, okay? I share the questions here in Zoom and I also share them in the WhatsApp group. I'm going to get you into small groups so you can share the info among yourself. Okay? Lo divido en grupos para que compartamos la información. Let me check the groups. Okay, let's see. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, groups are created and open, guys. You will have five minutes to do the activity. Just five minutes, okay? Hurry up. Remember, you need to answer, I wake up, I leave home, I arrive, and always, before the time, remember to use at. Siempre antes de decir la hora, you use at, okay? I need to hear you using English. Remember, this is easy. I wake up at, in my case, I'll give you an example. I wake up at 5.30 a.m. I leave home at 6 a.m. I arrive to my job at 6.30. I have lunch at noon. I get back home at 5 p.m. You see? Very easy. That's what you are going to do, okay? Let's do it, guys. Um, what I do you weigh, weigh at? Um, 40 at four. At four. Bad. Yes. That um, time you do. What time do you? ¿Cómo se pronuncia lo, la siguiente palabra? What time you do? No, what time do you? Es que estoy moviendo los audífonos porque si no, no me oyen. Está lloviendo. Yes, but what time do you? What time you do? Ay. Wake up. Wake up.
Just two minutes, guys. Just two minutes. Okay, guys, let's see, let's see, let's see. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see, vamos a ver. What time do you wake up, uh, Carla Beatriz? Hello. What time do you wake up? I head up at 40. I have 20 minutes. How is it? 20 p.m. Okay, perfect. Excellent. What time do you arrive to your job? Um. In the SIS. What time do you arrive to your job? I arrive at six. I arrive. I arrive. I arrive at six p.m. in the morning. Okay. Excellent. Thank you very much. Thank you, teacher. Now let's see, Robert. Hello, Robert. Hello, teacher. Okay, Robert, I need you to ask the questions to Catherine, please. Okay, Catherine, are you there? Uh -huh. Okay, the first one say, what time do you wake up? At 5 a.m. 
Okay, the second question say, what time do you have, do, what time do you, do you leave for work? At 5.50 a.m. Okay, the third question say, what time do you arrive to your job? At 6. Do you have lunch? At 11. But I think you could say I have lunch at the oh. time you, you say. It. Oh, but you it's okay. Give me, it's okay if she says it like that. It's okay if she says it yeah, like that. Yeah, I know. Okay. The last one say, what time do you do you get back home? At 5 p.m. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Now let's see, David. Hello, teacher. David, I need you to ask the questions to, uh, 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 let's see, you're going to ask Judy. Okay. Hello, Judy. Hello. And the first question, what time do you wake up? I at uh, I at half past five. Okay, the, the, the second, what time do you do you let home for work? Pardon, we at is uh, uh, 10 past 5. Uh, okay. He lit home for work. I at half past 5. Do you reveal your home? Mm. Leave it home for work. Okay. And the next, what time do you have lunch? At half past one. At half and, past one. Um, Please continue, continue. The, okay, on the last question, what time do you get back home? Um, I at um, a quarter Quarter to five. Quarter to five. No, because cuarto a las seis. Quarter to six. Quarter to six. Quarter to six. Quarter to six. Yes. Okay, perfect. Thank okay. you. Excellent. Thanks, both of you guys. Now let's see, Roxana. Please ask the questions to Fatima Lisset. Okay. Fatima? Hello? Uh, what time do you wake up? I die 25. Okay. What time do you leave? Leave? Uh, for it could go at six. Okay. What time do you arrive? Do you hope? Arrive at six fix okay. What time do you have lunch? Uh, it have lunch at eleven fifteen. Okay. What time do you head back home? Arrive home uh, fix five. Okay. Thanks. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Fatima Laura. Hello, teacher. I need you to ask the questions to Victor. Okay, Victor, what time do you wake up? Thank you. 
Victor. Hello. Okay. Start again, Fatima. Victor, what time do you wake up? I wake up at 5.20. What time do you leave home for work? I leave my home, uh, home at 5.40. What time do you arrive to your job? I arrive my job at 6.20. What time do you have lunch? I have lunch, I lunch at 12.40. What time do you get back home? I come back my home at 5.10. Thank you. Perfect, thank you. Now let's see, let's see. Mm -mm -mm. Catherine. Sí. Okay, Catherine, please ask the questions to Monica, Monica Liliana. Okay. Hello, Monica. Hello. What time do you wake up? At four. And you? Uh, at five. <laughs> what time you do live home for work? <laughs> at five fifty a.m. Do you live? Uh, do you live home? Do you live home? And you, Monica? Perdón, Orca. Okay. What time do you leave home for work? At five. At five. Okay. okay. What time do you arrive to your job? At five, forty. Okay. What time do you have lunch? At eleven, thirty. At eleven. Okay. Dichosa. <laughs> what time do you get back home? At 5.45. Thank you, Monica. Okay, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, guys. Now, let's see. Next activity. Okay, here we go. We got to say conversation. You got to listen to the pronunciation of the conversation. Then you're going to practice with a partner, okay? And the conversation goes like this. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is. But Julie is attending the conference this year too. So, I see. But if Julie is attending, who is delivering the presentations for the CEO next week? Guess what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. So, I am informing the committee about it. I repeat.
Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is. But Julie is attending the conference this year too. So? I see. But if Julie is attending, who is delivering the presentations for the CEO next week? Guess what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. So, I am informing the committee about it. I will repeat one last time, guys. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is. But Julie is attending the conference this year, too. So, I see. But if Julie is attending, who is delivering the presentations for the CEO next week? Guess what? I am. I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. So, I am informing the committee about it. Okay, guys, you go back to working groups. You will have four minutes to the practice. Groups are open. Lo comparto aquí. Si puedes. El teacher. Me what? Aquí de aquí. I don't say that. ¿Y por qué lo dice entonces? I don't say it. Yo no lo digo. ¿Sí lo dice? Of course not. Hola, ¿por qué no le puede decir? Ve, teacher, si sí lo dijo en medio de cuando está hablando. I don't do it. Ok, guys, practice, practice. Ahorita, teacher, ahorita. Delivery. The present for the news week. The week. Pues, what I am. Guess what? I am present. ¿Cómo? Guess what? Guess what? Guess what? Guess what? I am, I am presenting with Hector the new accountant. Sounds great. So I am informative the committee about it. Hoy empiezo. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hi, Peter. Wait. Maria as about Julia is attended the conference this year to show. I see. But if Julia is attending, who is delivering the representation for the CEO next week?
Where's what? I am present with Hector, the new accountant. So great. So I am informing the committee about it. Hola. Repitemos. Hola. Aquí me Hola. toca. Yes. Uh, eh, Roxana. Es que, Roxana. Eres, Roxana. Es que no me podía el teléfono el porque el otro no me. <risa> no, es que me cambié el teléfono, el otro no me, no me metí a los grupos. Ok. Yo no podía encender el micrófono. No. Ah. <risa> Ok, aquí estamos. Sí, sí. En, en el diálogo. Eh, sí. Peter, Peter y Henry, ¿verdad? Ajá. Sí. Esa es. Vale. Sí. ¿Quién empieza? Yo. Hello, hello Henry. I have a question. Soy. ¿Cómo se pronuncia, teacher? Soy. Who is representative? The representative. Who? Who? Who, who, is, who is representing? Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Uh, hey Peter. Well, Maria is. Okay, 60 seconds and everybody comes back. Okay, guys, let's see. David Armando and Carla Beatriz, please. <laughs> yeah, you are the first, you are the first, you're group number one. Okay. Yeah. Empiece usted. Okay. Hello, Henry. I have the question. Who is representing the company and their juggling conference? Hey Peter, well, Maria is about Julie is attending the conference this year too. So I see. Book is Julie is attending. Who is delivering them representing for the CEO next week? Uh, guess what? 
I am I am present presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Accountant. Uh, so great. So I am inform informing they committed a body. Okay, perfect. About it. About yeah. it. About it. About okay. Excellent. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, teacher. teacher. Ana Maria and Fatima Lisset, please. Yes. Hello, Henry. The question what is representative the company in Jersey? Conference. Hey, Peter. Well, Mary is, but Julie is attending the conference this year to so. I see, but in in Julia is attending with delivery to presentation for to see you next week. Guess what? I am, I am presenting with Hector the new accountant. So great. So I am informing the committee about it. About it. About it, guys. About it. Thank you. Let's see, Brenda Díaz and Catherine Guadalupe. <laughs> Brenda, you start. Hello. Hello, Henry. I have a question. What is representative? The company in the yearly conference. Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is, but Julie is attending the conference this year. Two, so I see. Good is Julie in is attendee who is developing the representation for the sale next week. Where's what I am? I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. So I am informing they. Committee about it. Finish. About it. About it. About it. Did you attend that? About it. Yeah, yes. We will take it after the, the conversations, okay? Fatima Laura and Robert Beltran. Fatima, you start. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is. But Julie is attending the conference this year, too. So. I see. But if Julie is attending, who is delivering the representation for the CEO next week? Guess what? Um, I am presenting with Hector. The new accountant. Sounds great. So I am informing the committee about it. About it. About it. Perfect. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Cool. Very well. Good. Good pronunciation. Monica Liliana and Roxana Ramirez. Oh, I'm sorry. I guess Monica was having a little problem. Uh, Roxana and Victor. Um, I'm sorry, and Yuri. Okay. Yes, Roxana, you start. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is. But Julie is attending the conference this year too, so? Is she, I see. Is 
I see. I see, but if Julie is attending, who, who is who is delivering the representatives represents for the CEO next week? Guess. Guess what? Guess. Guess what? Guess what? I am. I am representing with Hector, the new accountant. Song right. So. Sounds. I, song. Sounds, sounds great. great. Sounds great. So I am informant. Esa palabra, teacher. I am presenting. Informing. Ah, I am informing. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I am informing. I see informing. Yep. I am informing the coming about. Okay. Now, Roxana, listen to me. Sounds. 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 Like that. Sounds. Sounds great. Sounds great. Okay. Let's see. Robert. Hello, Robert. Okay, Robert and Victor, please, Robert, help me. Victor, you ready? Uh, yes. Okay, Robert, start. Teacher, teacher. Yes. Uh, the... the conversation, Robert, can the you help me? Where's the conversation? The conversation, where is the conversation? Because I closed my... You have the conversation there. Thank you, Bisha. Okay, I'm gonna start. Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is, but Julie is attending the conference this year too. So. I see, but if Julie is attending, who is delivering the presentation for the CEO next week? Guess what? I am. I am presenting with, with Hector, the new accountant. Sounds great. So I am informing the committee about it. Perfect, guys. Thank you very much. Okay, guys, let's see, let's see. Well, here we got the present continuous. Now, let me explain something, okay? Uh, you know that the present continuous, oh, the attendance, my bad, sorry. Ana Maria Rivas Durán. Present. Brenda Angelica Díaz de Chacón. Present, teacher. Cindy Sibania Rodríguez Leiva. David Armando Romero Hernández. Present teacher. Fátima Laura Mejía Meléndez. Present teacher. Fátima Lisset Pineda Paniagua. Present. Guillermo José Osorio Ventura. Present. Jaime Enríquez Flores Sánchez. Jose Roberto Ramírez Beltrán. Thank you, Mr. Karen Tatiana Menéndez Aguirre. Karen Zuleima López Martínez. Carla Beatriz García de la O. Present teacher. Catherine Guadalupe García Chachagua. Present. Libni Rocío Rivera Lemos. Mónica Liliana Ocotán Barahona. Present. Nelson Stanley Cardona Hernández. Patricia Verónica Linares Mengíbar. Roxana Elizabeth Ramírez Lima. Present, teacher. Víctor Alberto Trujillo Cruz. Present. Shuri Magdalena Villanueva de Trinidad. Present. Excellent. Thank you, guys. Well, 
as I was explaining to you, the present continuous. Well, you know that the present continuous is used to express uh, usually an action that is happening right at the moment that the sentence is being said, right? Usamos el presente continuo para hablar sobre la acción en el momento que se dice. Like, I am teaching a class. You are listening to me. Catherine is messing up with her hair. Okay? Uh, let's see who, what else can we say? Oh, I am writing. Stanley is having problems with connection. And let's see. Oh, Monica is suffering with the flu. Those are things that are happening in this moment. But the present continuous, as you know, present continuous is used. Uh, let me explain in another way. Okay, here we go. Okay, you know that the present continuous is like uh, I am teaching a class. You are listening to me. Okay, when? Right now. In this moment, right? So if you notice, these two sentences are in present continuous. Now, the present continuous follows a specific structure. The structure for the present continuous is we got us the subject, then we got uh, the auxiliary. The auxiliary in this case is the verb be. So it can be am, um, can be is, or could be are, right? After this, we got us a verb, the verb in the ing form, okay? And then we have a complement. That's the structure for present continuous affirmative form, okay, right? Subject plus auxiliary plus um, is R plus B, verb in the ING plus complement. Now, you know that this expresses something that is happening in this moment, okay? When we talk about this, we are talking about something that is happening right in this moment, okay? All this is happening right now, okay? Now, this is present continuous, the form, the normal form, okay? Now, we got another use for the present continuous. Which one is that one? Is when we use the future with present continuous. Remember, guys, that the present continuous is also called present progressive. It's the same. Okay? Now, the structure is exactly the same. But... What are we talking about? Ah, here there's a little thing that changes. Aquí hay una pequeña cosa que cambia. What's that? Look, what changes is that in this case, we are talking about a future plan. Okay? It also... Uh, it gives the idea of more than one person participates in the plan, okay? And we use a future time expression. Like what? Oh. 
I am having a meeting. I am having a meeting uh, early tomorrow. Look at this sentence. Let's look at it. I am having a meeting early tomorrow. In this case, we are using a sentence that, you see, in this case, we are using a sentence that refers to the future. How? ¿Cómo que se refiere al futuro? Oh, very simple. The future is expressed right here. Look, with the time expression, with tomorrow. Okay, so that means that the the it's the time expression the one that let us know la que nos dice a nosotros that the idea is for the future. Okay, so I am having a meeting early tomorrow. Okay, in the meeting. Of course, it's not going to be just me. No voy a estar yo solo, no? That's why it's a future plan and implies more than one participant. Questions? Preguntas? Hello? Okay. Let me share, I'm going to share with you what I just wrote. ¿Les parece que les comparta lo que acabo de, compa de hacer? Well, I'm going to share it, guys. Yes, I, I hope it's useful for you. Espero que les sirva. Fisher, this is like uh, present progressive. It's the same. True present continuous false. is present progressive. El presente continuo también but se le llama presente progressive. We are using having in the I saw before uh, using for make a sentence in the present progressive going to. It is no, like going the same. to is another type of future. I mean, going to is used to express a different type of future. The thing is this, Robert, we got three different futures. We, you got simple future, okay? Tenemos el futuro simple. Future with be going to and future with present continuous. Each okay. one of them I expresses never, I, a different I, idea. Cada uno okay. expresa una idea distinta. The future with will, like I will work tomorrow. Okay, that's a prediction. El futuro con will no expresa continuous. una predicción or expresses a sudden decision o una decisión súbita. Like, uh, imagine that you are, you are walking, you pass by the store, pasa cerca de la tienda, and you say, mm, I'll buy a soda. Voy a comprar una soda, dice usted. That's a sudden decision. Future with will. I will buy a soda. Okay? Yeah. I'm telling you, I will go to the beach one of these days. Voy a ir a la playa mm -hmm. un día de esto. That's a prediction. It's not sure. No es seguro. Okay. Okay. Now, present with be going to. Oh, I am going to buy a soda tomorrow for lunch. That's a future plan. But okay. a personal future plan. It implies just one person. Implica que solo hay una persona. Making the decision, making the plan. Okay. okay. Now, future with the be going to. Going to. Future with uh with present continuous. El futuro con el presente continuo. It this one expresses a future arrangement. Expresa un arreglo futuro, un plan futuro. But it implies that there's one more than one person. More than one person when when we are going to talk. Uh, 
More than one. More than one. No, lo que pasa es de que en el plan que usted está haciendo, no está usted solo. Es distinto que yo le diga, yo me voy a comprar una soda mañana para el almuerzo yeah, porque yeah. You say voy a almorzar this, algo especial. This example we're going to. Ok. But I have to if use I, present continuous. I am having a meeting tomorrow. When there are so many people. Yes, in, in the plan. meeting. Guys, okay. we are having class tomorrow at 7. It's not just me. It's a lot of people right here. That's a okay, future teacher, plan. Thank you. Okay. That's something that you must remember, guys. Any other question? Otra pregunta? It's a clear teacher. Thank you. Okay. What about you guys? The rest of you? El resto de ustedes? Okay. Okay, guys, let me share with you now. Let me compartir this. Here we go. Okay. So you see in the manual, in the insta for manual, in page number 30, you have how to use present continuous for future events. We use present continuous to talk about arrangements for events at that time later than now. So what I just told you, subject, the verb be, it's am, um, is are, the main verb in gerund, el verbo principal en gerundio, the main verb in ing form. Esto quiere decir el verbo con el ing. Plus the complement. I am meeting the interns tomorrow. This action will take place in the future, tomorrow. What time is Maria interviewing the people? Ah, oh, she's interviewing them at 5 p.m. I am writing the report next week. Nice. And I am sending it as soon as you finish. Okay. So the exercise for you guys is this. You have to unscramble these sentences. Look, the sentences are in this order. You need to get them in the correct order. You're going, I'm going to send you to the groups. You're going to correct them in the right order and you're going to send them to me one per group okay me la van a enviar ya ordenadas uno por grupo questions no okay let me send you to the groups i will send you the screenshot in a second ya les envío el screenshot Ah. ah, pero como aquí ya está la estructura de ahí, nos vamos a guiar. Yes, you gotta de... use it to get them in order. <laughs> Ajá. Bueno, la primera ya está, ya vio, ya puedes tener ahí de la idea cómo va a ser. Sería, entonces sería. Uh, the, 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 
Teacher. Eh, sería the letter next. The, sí, the letter. Y the next week. I don't, ya sería lo I don't último, know. I don't know. I don't know. Hola. Yo no sé, yo no sé. <laughs> the letters the no. next week. Mark is sending the letters the next week. Yeah. <laughs> sí, así es. Mark okay. is sending the letters the next week. No, not no. the next week. The next week. The next week. No, listen, 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 listen. Usted me está acentuando la T. Eh, la entonación sube en week. The next 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 week. Okay. The next week. Hay que decir más despacio la T. The next no, más suave. The next week. The next, the next week. week. The um, next week. The next week, teacher. Yep. The next week. With uh, the Jane is. Um, three, three, um, Jane, uh -huh. Working. Esta cosa me corrige. Jane. Jane. Sería Jane y siempre, ¿verdad? Y sí. Working o Tony. Working. Working sería. Sí. Ah, sí. Working. Working. Sí, porque ING. Yeah. Working. Working. Tony on the report. Sí. Tony on the report. Tony. Bien, está trabajando esta noche en los reportes. Ok. La cuatro. Uch. Walter. Uh. Y sin. 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 Sí. Mm. Okay. So check. La cuatro sería Walter. Ah, Walter is signing. Signal. Okay. Uh, is signing. 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 Today the check. Mm -hmm. The mm -hmm. checks today. Checks today. Always the time mm -hmm. expression goes at the end. Siempre la time that expression al final. Uh, that's today the check. Today. La cinco. Marina. Organizing. Organizing. Marina. The presentation. Mm -hmm. In the afternoon, Marina está organizando la presentación en la tarde. Organizing. <laughs> Que va a usar a esto. The presentation. The presentation in the afternoon. Which. Mm. Which. Mm. 
última. Guillermo. Is going to the back tomorrow. Guillermo irá al banco mañana. Sería Guillermo. Sí. Guillermo is going to the back tomorrow. Next week. Next week. Is going to the back the bank el banco back. mañana back. tomorrow bank. Yeah, I see the same. Tomorrow. Sí. Quedaría mal y ser en el lerma. ¿De lerma? ¿De lerma? Sí. La siguiente. Jane. Okay, let's bring everybody back.
Okay, guys, let's see. Vamos a ver. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. David and Carla, you got the first one, number two, sentence number two. How you got it? ¿Cómo les quedó? Um, Mark. Okay, Mark. Is sending. Uh -huh, let's see, Mark is sending the letters, the letters, the next week, the next week. Well, that's perfect, guys. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. Bye. So you. Sentence number three goes to Ana Maria. Jane. Okay, Jane. Is. Uh -huh. Working. Perfect. On the reports. Tonight. The reports tonight. Perfect. Thank you. Sentence number four goes to, let's see, Brenda, Catherine, and Stanley. Okay, guys, what you got for me? Walter. Okay, Walter. Is. Uh -huh. Is. Signing. 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 Today. Signing the checks. Today. Today. Remember, the time expression always goes at the end, okay? Time expression always at the end. Teacher. Yes. Este, le íbamos a enviar todas las respuestas al grupo. Yes, please. Maya, ya se las mando. Next one goes to, let's see, Fatima Laura, Robert, and Bill, and Victor. Okay, who's gonna read for me? Okay, the number third. This uh, Walter is singing. No, I'm sorry, number five. Number five, Robert. Number five. Mariana is organizing the presentation in the afternoon. Okay, Marina is organizing the presentation in the afternoon. Perfect. Thank you. Marina is organizing the presentation in the afternoon. Excellent. And the last one goes to Monica, Roxana, and Yuri. Okay, guys, who's going to talk to me? ¿Quién me dicta? Uh, Guillermo. Uh -huh. is Guillermo. going to is going to the bank is going to tomorrow. The bank tomorrow. Bank the bank tomorrow. Guillermo is going to the bank tomorrow. Okay, guys, yeah. that's completely correct. So the sentences go like this. Number one, Jose is receiving the new workers tomorrow. Number two, Mark is sending the letters the next week. Jane is working on the reports tonight. Walter is signing the checks today. Marina is organizing the presentation in the afternoon. Guillermo is going to the bank tomorrow. Okay, perfect. Questions about the sentences? Preguntas?
Okay, guys. Now, let's see. Yo, teacher. Yes, tell me. Este, ¿verdad que cuando es aquí el futuro con el presente continuo, este, lo que vamos a hacer, digamos, en un futuro, digamos, la palabra tonight es, va de último en la oración? Yes, always the time expression goes at the end. Las time expression van siempre al final. If you, if you place them at the beginning, must be separated from the sentence by a comma. Si la llega a poner al inicio, mm -hmm. tiene que ir separada de la oración por una coma. Oh, bueno. Muchas gracias. Tomorrow, I am calling you. Don't forget. You see? <laughs> Tomorrow, hago una pausa. I am calling you. That little pause is the comma. Esa pequeña pausa es mm -hmm. la coma. Okay? Okay. Thank you, teacher. Thanks to you. Okay, guys, let's see. Okay. Now, guys, conversation time. I got a couple of questions for you. Like, the questions are these. What is your hobby? How long have you had your hobby? Number two is, how long have you had your hobby? ¿Cuánto tiempo ha tenido su hobby? Why do people have hobbies? ¿Por qué la gente tiene hobbies? Why did you start your hobby? ¿Por qué comenzó usted con el suyo? Okay. Those four questions we are going to answer working in groups. Do you understand the questions? ¿La entendemos? Remember, we are talking about hobbies, pasatiempos. Okay. Okay, guys, I'm sending you to the groups. You're going to work with the same people. Trabajamos los mismos.
and um, yo tengo como tres tiempos siempre ¿Por qué la gente tiene aflicciones? My favorite hobby is watch basketball, play, and watch anime and dramas. I love to watch. The how low head do you have? How long? The the how long? Time. How long? In the in the second. No, es que dice cuánto tiempo has tenido este pasatiempo. Um, eight, How long have? Eight, eight. Como unos. Tengo 29 años. Uh, ten years. Old. 10 años. Mm, ok. And the trick question and uh, and the crazy why do people have the hobby? Porque la gente tiene un hobby. Bueno, buena pregunta. Um, es algo que lo saca, digamos, de la rutina. Mm -hmm. Okay, to get out of Hi. the routine. That's a good answer. Okay, let's see, let's see, Robert. 
I'm here. Tell me, Robert, what's your hobby? My hobby, I daily play on my cell phone, PUBG Mobile, Free Fire 2, and then I ride my bike after work, after work with my niño. Okay, perfect, perfect. <laughs> How long have you had your hobbies? Uh, I ride my bike like two months ago, more okay. or less, I'm not sure. Okay, perfect. Thank you. I always play yes, on my yes, cell phone. Me. Always. Uh -huh. I That's always cool. play on my cell phone um, for about five years ago. That is alone. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you. Catherine, what about you? What's your hobby? My hobby is uh read books uh-huh and tell and... me why do you have that hobby why do you like reading books yeah. mm. i like that it transports me to another world oh. i relax me it relaxes me. It relaxes me. Me hablan y me pierden ahí. Yeah, I know, I know the feeling. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. Fatima Lisette. Hello. Hello, Fatima. What's your hobby? Tell me, tell me. Uh, my hobby is play soccer. Okay. Wow. Okay. How long have you played soccer? Um, two years. Two years. Excellent. Yes. Excellent, excellent. Thank you. David Armando. Thank you. Hello, teacher. What is your hobby, David? Uh, my hobby, um, my hobby is not specific. Um, I like to um, prepare my car. Okay. Oh, really? You like fixing the car? Excellent. Tell me, David, why do you think people have hobbies? What's your opinion? <laughs> um, uh, uh, my friend Carla and um, um, the speaker this is break the routine. <laughs> okay, to get rid of the routine. Excellent, thank you. Mm. Okay. Victor, what about you? What's your hobby, Victor? Hi. Uh, my hobby is playing video games. Okay. Excellent. How regularly do you play video games? Uh, three, three times. Three times. Okay. Three times for for week. Yes. Okay. Excellent. Thank you. Let's see. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, Ana Maria, what about you? What's your hobby, Ana Maria? Three hobbies. Okay, okay. Um, the first. Uh -huh, tell me. Hobbies. The second, craft. And the three, watch anime and mangas. Okay, okay. Excellent. Watch anime and manga. Okay. Oops. I'm so sorry. Now let's see. Thank you very much. And where did she go? 
Roxana, what about you? Tell me, Roxana. Hi, teacher. What's your hobby? Uh, well, comic. Oh, really? You yeah. like comics? What's your favorite comic? Uh, fantastic story. Este, no. El de Yuri le estaba diciendo. Eh, great, great, good. Así se dice. Las historietas de los dioses griegos. Oh, great, Greek gods. Greek, Greek gods. gods. Oh, that's cool. So you like mythology? Sí. Yeah, yeah, that's nice. I like it too. Well, thank you, Roxana. Oh my gosh, guys, okay. I'm so sorry. It's time already. Wow. Time flies. El tiempo se nos fue volando. Let me get the final attendance so you can go to rest. Let's see. Ana Maria Rivas Durán. Present, teacher. Okay. Brenda Angélica Díaz de Chacón. Present teacher. Thank you, Brenda. Sandy Sibania Rodríguez Leiva. David Armando Romero Hernández. Present teacher. Fátima Laura Mejía Meléndez. Present teacher. Fátima Lisset Pineda Paniagua. Present. Guillermo Josué Osorio Ventura. Present teacher. Jaime Enrique Flores Sánchez. José Roberto Ramírez Beltrán. Present. Karen Tatiana Menéndez Aguirre. Karen Zuleima López Martínez. Carla Beatriz García de la O. Present teacher. Catherine Guadalupe García Chachagua. Present teacher. Libni Rocío Rivera Lemus. Mónica Liliana Ocotán Barahona. Present. Nelson Stanley Cardona Hernández. Present teacher. Patricia Verónica Linares Mengíbar. Roxana Elizabeth Ramírez Lima. Present teacher. Víctor Alberto Trujillo Cruz. Present. Yuri Magdalena Villanueva de Trinidad. Present. Well, guys, thank you very much. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Work on the platform. Please work in the platform. Good night, teacher. Yes, good night. teacher. Good night, teacher. Good night, teacher. It was a thank pleasure you. to be here to you, teacher. Thanks to you, guys. The pleasure night, is all teacher. mine. Bye-bye. Good night, teacher. Teacher, yo le quería pedir un favor. Uh -huh. Si me podría explicar lo del presente que estuvo diciendo en español, porque en inglés no lo entendí muy bien y me han quedado vale. bastante. Pero si sí entiende el presente continuo. Más o menos. El presente, ah, el presente continuo lo usamos para decir cosas que están pasando en el momento, como por ejemplo, yo estoy hablando con Fátima. Ajá. Fátima me está escuchando a mí. Esta terminación, ando, ¿ok? Ando. Eso es el presente continuo. I am talking to Fátima. Fátima is listening to me. ¿Ok? Talking. Usted conoce el verbo talk, right? Al talk le agregamos la ing y se convierte en talking, uh -huh. que es hablar, ¿verdad? Tenemos listen, que es escuchar. Look, listening. Le ponemos esa ing. Ahora, el verbo cero estar funciona como un auxiliar. I am talking. She is listening. Okay. You are studying. Usted está estudiando. That's present continuous. Eso es el presente continuo. Hasta ahí o vamos sea, bien. En el presente continuo solo se conjuga el verbo agregándole ing. Exacto. Pero lleva antes el, el verbo. El verbo be. Uh -huh. 
El verbo be. Ajá, el am is or are. ¿Ok? Ok. Ese va antes, ese funciona como un auxiliar. Usted sabe que el am va con I, ¿verdad? I am. Sabe sí. que el is es con he, she o it. Y sabemos que el are es con you, we, they. ¿Vamos bien ahí? Sí. Ok. Ahora, también se utiliza el presente continuo. Yo le dije que se usaba para decir cosas que están pasando en el momento, right? Yes. But we also use it to express future. Pero también lo utilizamos para expresar futuro. ¿Cuál futuro? Un futuro que está... Algo que usted está planeando. Algo que ya está planeado para el futuro. Pero un plan en el cual participan más de una persona. ¿Sí? Sí. Como por ejemplo, yo le digo, yo le dije, ok, guys, we are having class tomorrow at 8. Tenemos clase mañana a las 8. Right? Yeah. ¿Quiénes la tenemos? Todos, somos un montón en el grupo, ¿no? Uh -huh. Vea, ¿qué cambió? We are having class. Una oración en presente continuo. Pero desde el momento que le pongo el tomorrow, se convirtió en futuro porque el tomorrow es mañana. Uh -huh. ¿Ok? Ok. I am having dinner after the class. I am having dinner. Yo voy a cenar después de la clase. Ahora, lo que no tiene que tratar de hacer es de traducirlo directamente porque no tiene sentido. Solo que desde el momento que usted le ve la expresión, la time expression del futuro, usted automáticamente entiende que es futuro. ¿Ok? Ya no estoy, ya no estoy diciendo, I am talking to, I am calling Fátima uh, next week. I am calling Fátima next week. No estoy diciendo, yo estoy llamando a Fátima la próxima semana. No tiene sentido, ¿verdad? No. Sería, yo voy a llamar a Fátima la próxima semana. ¿Qué lo convirtió en futuro? Es el next week. Next. Uh -huh. La time expression es la que lo vuelve futuro. O sea que la, la expresión de futuro es la que la vuelve la oración futuro. Ya la vuelve en Exactamente. futuro. Exactamente. Okay. Entonces hay dos maneras de hacer una oración así con presente, con futuro de presente continuo, conjugando con, el verbo. Con y... presente continuo, lo que pasa es que el presente continuo le expresa a usted algo que está pasando en el momento, pero si yo le pongo una time expression futuro, ya dejó de ser presente continuo y se convirtió en futuro con presente continuo. Ok. Okay, entiendo. No sé si me expliqué. Sí. Vale. Cualquier duda, avíseme. Estoy para ayudarle, ¿ok? Vaya. Gracias, teacher. No, my pleasure. Have a good night. Buenas noches. Pase buenas noches.
Well, that's it for tonight. See you tomorrow.